Have you wanted to change your phone to know the weather better? For me, every time I get up, I don't want to go through and go into a weather app. I just want to know if it's nice outside. Do I need a coat, an umbrella? How is my day going to go? And with the new iOS 16 update, they have added weather to the main screen. So now on your home screen, as you go through and unlock your phone, you can see the current weather and what type of weather is going on. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you in this video how to go ahead and set this up. It's fairly easy, so if you are not an expert, don't worry, I'll walk you through it step by step and we'll get you all set up. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin from HelpfulTutorials.net and if you like iPhone tips, tricks, and tutorials, do me a favor, smack that subscribe button, I'd really appreciate it. With that said, let's go ahead and dive right in and show you exactly how to set your phone up. The end goal will show you your phone looking like this. The animation quickly plays and then it kind of stays steady on the screen. So it won't continue to play, it just plays for a moment. And when you unlock it, also inside the phone, you'll see the background of what the current weather is. So now it's cloudy with a little bit of rain clouds in the air. So you can kind of see that at nighttime, if you're looking at your phone, it may have stars out, which is really nice. And it kind of changes throughout the day. So let's go through and show you exactly how to set this up. First thing we wanna do from the main screen is go ahead and choose settings. When we're in settings, we are going to find wallpaper and go ahead and select that. Once we choose wallpaper, what we want to do is choose add new wallpaper. When you're here, it's going to give you some categories that you can quickly jump down into, or you could kind of scroll through them all. So for me, I'm just going to choose weather. But if I wanted to go through them all, you can see featured, suggested photos, photo selfies, weather, astronomy, you got emojis, collections, and colors. For us, we are gonna go ahead and choose the weather, and the weather one's gonna come up and show you how it's set up. If you like it as it is, all you need to do is add some widgets if you want a little more information, which I do suggest. So to do that, we're just gonna go and hit Add Widgets, and here you can choose a few different things that you would like. So for me, I want to choose the weather. When you choose weather, you'll be able to choose which ones you like, I like this one personally because it gives me a quick idea of everything, the high and the low of the day and what it currently is. You can go through them and get a better idea if you wanted other things. UV index, sunrise, sunset, the moon, precipitation, wind, and air quality. For me, I like the big display. And then after that, I like the little display. So it depends on what I'm looking for and how I could do it. If we had unlimited space, I would definitely add more stuff, but I can only add one other thing. And since I'm always setting alarms and stuff, I like to have the clock. So I'm gonna set the alarm so I can see when my next alarm is gonna go off, you know, to keep me ready if I have a video I gotta do, if I have to be on a meeting, or if I have to go pick up my kids from school, anything there. So I keep that there. And then I hit the X to get out of here. And now it's important to hit add on the top right and then go ahead and hit set as paired if you want them to be paired. What paired is, it means it's gonna show you on your lock screen, but it's also gonna show you inside the phone like I showed you. So your background is gonna also be clouds when it's cloudy or rain if it's rainy, sunshine if it's sunny and so on. I like to keep them paired, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit set wallpaper as paired. And at this point, we can go ahead and swipe up. We can lock the phone and then wake it up. And you can see here, it's cloudy. It's got the high and the low. It's currently 77. And then there's another one that says it's 76. <laughs> so it also gives you the high and low, but I kind of like having both, I don't know. I'm, I guess I'm still trying to decide which one I like best. And then I have my alarms. If I tap on my alarms, it takes me right to my alarms. And you can put other things there as well. As I mentioned, since it's set paired, you can see the clouds also in this position here. So now you have that set up. Now, if you had a wallpaper, you don't have to worry. It's not gone. So if I lock the phone again and then I wake it up and then I tap and hold, it's going to go ahead and put it so I can choose multiple ones. Now, if I swipe to the left, you can see I already had it added, so I added it a second time. But if I go it again, I can see my wife and I can choose her again if I want that. 
Now, if I want to go back, I just tap and hold and then go ahead and choose it. If you want to change the widgets on it, you just tap and hold and hit customize. And now you can choose where you want. Like, for example, I can click in here and I can change the fonts and color. A lot of times people don't like how bold it is when the new phone goes live because this new update is really bold. It took me a while to get used to. But here you can change the fonts and you can also make it a different color if you'd like. That's kind of a neat color. Maybe I'll try that out for a bit. See how I like it. And you can go ahead and then hit X and then done. And then that's going to be your new color. And again, I can just hit set. So they're all good. And now I have that new color. And it, it kind of brings it out pretty nice. I like the little offset. Though you probably can't see it as well as I can because you're not looking at the phone itself. And that is how we set the weather as our lock screen. So now we know how to see the weather without going into our weather app every day. This is really big in the morning when you're in a rush and you know you have to get the kids ready for school. You're pretty much good to go. So I hope this helped. If it did, do me a favor, smack that like button. I'd really appreciate it. And I want to thank you so much for the view.